Well, Lewis's introductions go. That was pretty impressive. I think it was about three minutes before you uh, you opened your Stanley account. How pleased are you with tonight and, and that debut? Yeah, no, it's uh, <laughs> it's uh, it was great to get the start and uh, to get 45 minutes under my belt. Uh, firstly, um, and the goal came as a bonus, nice and early. Um, so I think the most important thing for me was just to try and get some minutes um, and try and get my fitness back up to uh, where where it normally is. I know you've been around the club training and working with the players for, for a little while. It must have been a very strange time to be doing that, but how big an opportunity was it to get out there tonight? Oh yeah, I'm glad to, to get it and to get it so soon after signing just last week. Um, and hopefully I've, I've shown what I, what I can do. Um, obviously, hopefully I can improve, become fitter and uh, be able to play the full 90. Um, and keep up a good uh, good performance for all the, the full nighter. Just talk to me about the goal because it, it looked to me like Porch's instincts inside the penalty area just, just reacting. Is, is that the case? Just kind of being in the right place at the right time? Yeah, it, I, I saw it kind of building up on the on the right hand side and I was just kind of lingering around the uh, six yard box um, and I can't remember who crossed it, I think it was Ryan. If, as soon as I saw him get half a yard I just kind of threw my threw my body to the to the front post and I managed to just get the the little touch on um, and sneak it in the near post. You mentioned that it's it's really early for you in terms of time frame to get it fit and also in, in your standing career. It must be a weight off though to have already scored after forty five minutes or three minutes. It might yeah, yeah, it was. Uh, it's it's always good to to score for a new club as soon as you can and to get that three minutes into. My first start, well, the first my first appearance, it was a uh, huge weight lifted off my shoulders, and hopefully it'll uh, it'll help me progress and go on to score a lot more. Nice to be home. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, it's good to be home. Um, it was good being away, but it's I, I, I do prefer being uh, a lot closer to home. So yeah, it's uh, it's good. Obviously, you come into a side that, that's got a lot of young players, particularly in forward areas. I guess that can help you in, in, in that competition up there. No Colby Bishop tonight, and you've got your opportunity. Yeah, no, um, and hopefully that with um, Colby not being here, it has given me the opportunity, and I believe that I've I've taken it to some extent. I've managed to get myself a goal and put in a, a decent shift in over the 45. Um, so hopefully, it puts puts me in the frame for what when I am needed or when a striker is needed. Obviously nobody would have wanted the two week layoff with the Covid situation and, and the managers have been talking about getting players back up to speed and getting their legs back. In some ways does that help you be competitive for the players because you don't have quite as far to catch up fitness wise and everybody's having to top their fitness up. Yeah I think it it helps not being the, the only one to have suffered and been away for two weeks um, and it, it kind of gives everyone a, a level playing field to, to build the fitness on. Obviously some players will be um, naturally fitter than others and, and things, but um, yeah, it def definitely helped and um, hopefully I can build build it up over the next few weeks. And there's a league game coming up now, is that going to be the next target for you to kind of state your claim to be involved for a, for a league match then? I think so, yeah. Um, I mean, I'll, hopefully I've shown enough tonight to, to warrant a place on the bench. Um, and possibly get some minutes. Um, so I'm, that's that's my aim now, really, to to get on the bench and to get some minutes.